Wayne Rooney, for who, example. Who you played with for many years very successfully and were good friends with him. And yet all this year, three or four times, he's come out and attacked you in the media. Is it jealousy as well, perhaps, that you're still playing and still in the probably, United States? Probably, Russia? because he finished his career with 30s, so I'm still playing high level. I'm not going to say that I'm looking better than him, which is, is true, but <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's hard to listen that kind of criticize and negative about people who play with you. For example, Gary Neville as well. I mean, Gary Neville, you blanked him the other day uh, on the pitch and he looked quite upset, actually. Um, because obviously he likes being your friend, but he's been pretty critical of you as well. The, you the people can have, can have his own opinion, but they don't really know what's going on, for example, inside the, the, the training ground and Carrington area or even my life. They should listen not only one point of view, they have to listen to my point of view as well. Are they so, still friends of yours or do you have a line where... They are not my friends. It's easy, it's easy to criticize. I don't know if you have a job in television that they must criticize. Do you think they use your name a bit to I think they take advantage of that because they are not stupid. It's hard when you see people who was in the dressing room with you criticizing that way. I'm not gonna sleep bad because of the criticize, but it's not good to listen that.